Hello, I'm David and you're watching Cruise Show UK. We're on Virgin Voyage's brand new cruise ship, The Valiant Lady, and we're gonna show you around our room, which is a sweetheart suite on deck 13. Let's go and have a look. Come on in, we'll have a look round. Come on in. And here we are. It's a beautiful room. Really, really like it. We had this on the Scarlet Lady uh, last year. Um, and it's pretty much the same, but it's just one deck down. Um, and yeah, as I said before, it's a sweet aft suite. Beautiful, beautiful room. And I have noticed that on this ship, they did update some of the cabins with uh, extra detail here and there. But in this room, they haven't changed anything. It's exactly the same as the Scarlet Lady, as far as I can see. It's a king size bed and the actual bed in the fabrics are really luxurious, um, super soft and silky. I really like this throw. Uh, it's, yeah, it's beautiful and it's freshly laundered each time. And then either side of the bed, you've got a, uh, a small bedside table and you've got light switches on both sides that control all the lights and you've got these uh, nice reading lights they're quite funky um, there's a power socket american style power socket on either side and there's two usb a sockets on either side as well which is really really good so on this side of the bed you've got this uh, tablet which controls everything in the room really controls the tv you can start the movies on the tv from here um, you control all the, the lights as well um, so there's different scenes it just sets up the uh, the room it can ch uh, draw the curtains open them that sort of thing just inside the door on the wall you've got the uh, heating controls for the room heating and cooling you've got some light switches as well you've got the uh, button for do not disturb and for the service uh, if you want your room made up just press that and it puts a light on outside the room so straight in and ahead of you you've got a double wardrobe um, there's plenty of space in here at the top you've got a nice big shelf uh, and then quite a lot of space there to hang your clothes and four drawers good size drawers at the bottom on another shelf and there's also the mini safe in there as well one just one little niggle um, that I will mention uh, with the wardrobe is these hangers they've got like a rubberized coating on them and so it, it I know it's stupid but it uh, it makes it quite difficult to put your clothes on that because it will get stuck uh, that's yeah just a bit of a weird uh, thing that I don't like but otherwise there's plenty of uh, room in that wardrobe on this side of the bed underneath you've got a big open space for your suitcases to go under and um, there's plenty of room in there for two big suitcases to go underneath and then on this side of the bed you've got two large uh, drawers underneath the bed they're a really good size you can get a lot of uh, clothes in there so at the end of the bed you've got a nice coffee table and a chair there's no couch here and the chair is not overly comfortable to be honest with you um, I would have liked to have seen some sort of a, a corner sofa or something um, but yeah and then you've got a large 55 inch uh, TV it's an LG screen really really nice and it can uh, swivel right round to watch while you're in bed one of the benefits of staying in a rock star suite is all of the included drinks in the minibar. All of this is included, the first round. Um, so you've got all these spirits, two lots of whiskey, tequila, there's uh, Bacardi rum and a bottle of vodka. Um, and then there's some mixers. I've had two of the mixers, but you get four mixers, a bottle of red wine, white wine, a bottle of Moe and four cans of uh, beer in the fridge there as well so you get a lot of alcohol included also in this area you've got the room telephone and you've got uh, still and sparkling water which is replenished as you use it and then there's a funky record player here uh, which is I guess it's a good um, uh, feature for the room there's plenty of drawers in this uh, section a large drawer here and then there's lots of glasses as well for all your cocktails and champagne 
shots, that sort of thing. Underneath, you've got the mini fridge on the one side, and then you've got three good sized drawers as well. Behind me, you've got the vanity area. It's a nice big mirror, nice and bright with those three funky lights. And then there's a small little desk area there with a drawer. There's a nice hair dryer in there as well. And you've got this small little poof. One of my favorite parts of the room is the bathroom. It's absolutely stunning. Let's go and have a look. It really is a stunning bathroom. The marble is luxurious and shiny, really, really good. The mirror is backlit. It's big and bright. It's beautiful. A uh, lovely big sink area. Um, you've got two glasses in here. There's some uh, hand lotion and you get a block of soap as well. Plenty of towels and the towels are really good. They're super long and thick and fluffy, really luxurious. Further along this end, you've got the toilet and again, the super fluffy towels. You get some makeup cloths, which is a good touch and uh, hand towels as well. Plenty of space here for all your toiletries. Uh, underneath, you've got a, a large shelf that runs the whole length. And then behind you get uh, some nice uh, bathrooms. At this end, you've got the beautiful shower. Uh, you've got this iridescent glass. There is a special name for it, but I can't remember it. But it's a, it's a beautiful shower. Again, all the marble. It's very luxurious and obviously this this porthole window is very unique lovely rainfall shower the only thing I will say is the the water pressure could be a little bit uh, uh, higher but it is really it's still a lovely lovely shower uh, and you get uh, included you get the shower gel you get some uh, shampoo and conditioner as well it's really good stuff so I don't think you really need to uh, bring your own stuff Let's go and have a look at the balcony now, which is really impressive. The curtains open automatically. There's buttons just at the side of the mini bar. So let's, uh, there we go, open sesame. Uh, this very, very impressive balcony is absolutely massive. Huge space. This would be fantastic in the Caribbean. It's a bit chilly here at the moment in, the, uh, in Belgium, but uh, in the Caribbean, this would really come into its own. So you get two very nice loungers out here. You also get obviously the signature hammock. Um, and then there's a small table and two chairs and uh, a little sofa there as well. Loads of space. In the Caribbean, this would be fantastic. If you're a fan of a wake view, this might be the room for you because, well, you don't get much better than this. It's fantastic. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, please give this video a like and subscribe as well. Take a look at all these cruises we've got coming for the rest of the year. Something for everyone. And that's it. I'll see you up on deck.